Welcome back to Testosterone Crusader. Today, we're diving into a topic that has been buzzing around the fitness community for quite some time, the anabolic window. You've probably heard the hype about the importance of consuming protein immediately after a workout for maximum gains. But is this anabolic window really a make or break factor in your muscle building journey? Let's find out. First things first, what exactly is the anabolic window? The anabolic window is the supposed time frame after your workout when your muscles are more receptive to nutrient intake, particularly protein. It's been suggested that consuming protein within this window, usually around 30 minutes to an hour post-exercise, can enhance muscle protein synthesis and promote better muscle growth. Now, let's dig into the science behind this concept. Numerous studies have explored the idea of the anabolic window, and interestingly, the results are not as clear-cut as you might think. Some studies indicate that consuming protein shortly after a workout can indeed boost muscle protein synthesis. However, others suggest that the overall daily protein intake and meal timing throughout the day might be more important than just focusing on that post-workout period. One study published in the Journal of the International Society of Sports Nutrition found that as long as your total protein intake for the day is adequate, the timing of protein consumption post-exercise may not significantly impact muscle protein synthesis. So, what does this mean for you in practical terms? Well, it implies that the anabolic window might not be as critical as once believed. Instead of stressing about consuming protein within a narrow time frame after your workout, it may be more beneficial to focus on your overall daily protein intake and distribute it across your meals throughout the day. It's essential to recognize that individual variability plays a role here. Some people may find that they feel better and recover faster when they consume a post-workout meal, while others might not notice a significant difference. Experimenting with different approaches and paying attention to how your body responds can help you determine what works best for you. Now, let's consider some other factors. The type of workout you do, your training goals, and your overall nutrition plan are all critical elements. If you're engaging in intense and prolonged workouts, your body's nutrient needs may differ from someone doing shorter, less intense sessions. Tailoring your nutrition to match your specific goals and workout routine is key. It's also worth debunking a couple of myths associated with the anabolic window. One common misconception is that if you miss the post-workout window, your entire workout is wasted. This is far from the truth. Your body is continually adapting to your exercise routine, and muscle repair and growth happen over an extended period, not just in the immediate aftermath of a workout. Generally, the anabolic window was a big thing maybe 10 or 20 years ago in bodybuilding, but nowadays seems like it's fizzled out a bit. Some people still swear by it, and others call it a 100% myth. Either way, there's only one way to find out for you. If you want to see if it works, then try it out for a month or so. Take a protein shake or eat some meat right after working out and see what happens. If you see better gains, then great. Keep doing it. If you don't notice a difference, then just do whatever you want to because it doesn't matter for you clearly. As I said earlier, the evidence is sort of scattered. One study will say it's important, and the next study says it doesn't matter. When you see something like this, it generally means that it will work for some people but not others. In conclusion, the anabolic window is a topic surrounded by varying opinions and research findings. While consuming protein after a workout may have its benefits, it's not necessarily the be-all and end-all for muscle growth. What seems to be more crucial is your overall daily protein intake, meal timing throughout the day, and consistency in your nutrition plan. Remember, everyone's body is different, so finding what works best for you is key. Pay attention to how your body responds, stay consistent with your training and nutrition, and most importantly, enjoy the journey to becoming the biggest version of yourself. Thanks for watching.